Hi, I apologize for my appearance. It ran out of conditioner and I had the bright idea to put canola oil in my hair. So, it's a little gravy. Um, this week's theme is memories. And really, when I think of memories, I think of a song. You'll come to realize that I often think of a lot of songs during a lot of times. I wish my life were a musical because that would make sense then. But here's my song. Making memories, making memories, taking pictures is making memories, catching little pieces of time, making them yours, making them mine. Great vacations and celebrations will fade away in a year. But when you're making memories, Happy days are always here. Happy days are always here. First real memory is getting in trouble for sticking a penny in my CPU when I was about in between one and two years old. I got in a lot of trouble for that. I remember got getting my butt busted for that. My happiest memory? Yeah. This I was about to be a dork for a minute, but I had to stop myself and explain my dorkery. Ashley, my dearest, dearest, dearest best friend, Ashley. Hi, Ashley. She um, suggested that I read the Harry Potter books because I had tried before. Boo, get down! I had tried before, but I didn't really like them. So she suggested I do it again. And uh, so I started, and I'm not going to lie, I'm kind of hooked. It's never going to equal my love for Star Wars, but I'm kind of hooked now. And um, I said I said something about my happiest memory, and then I was going to say something about a Patronus. But I stopped myself, but technically I didn't stop myself because I just told you about it anyway. <sighs> Whatever. My happiest memory is probably being in Tulsa. And I didn't like Tulsa. I hated Tulsa, but we lived in this two-bedroom apartment in Tulsa, and me and my sister shared a room, and we would have to clean our room, and I had this Kiara from The Lion King 2, it was this little room guard, it was like that tall, and you pushed a button on her, and she would be like, in 30 seconds I'm going to guard the room, 30, 29, she'd count down from 30, and then at the end of 30 seconds she'd go, Rawr! And then if you walk, she had a motion sensor on her. If you walk by, she'd roar and growl at you. Get out of this room or intruder alert or something like that. And uh, me and my sister, when we would clean my, clean our room, what we would do is we'd push the timer on Kiara and she'd start counting down from 30 seconds. And we'd clean as much as we could in 30 seconds. And then whenever she would roar, we'd throw ourselves on the floor and then crawl over to her and then reset her. And we did that for two or three hours and it was so much fun and we used to play games to clean up we used to play soldier where one of us was the drill sergeant and one of us was the private and I grew up in a military family and the drill sergeant would say private sir yes sir pick up that toy and put it away sir yes sir and then they'd put up the toy and then we'd switch and <laughs> we had a lot of games to clean our room because Cleaning our room was boring, and we had to we had to make it fun. And okay, so this memories thing is kind of hard for me. So what I've decided to do because number one, I'm stupid. Number two, I'm easily confused. And number three, I I don't know. I don't remember number three. We'll pretend there was a number three. But so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna sing a montage of songs having to do with memories or songs that evoke memories for me. So, okay, see see that right up there? It's right up there. The little X button. You can click it now. But, because I know you don't want to sit here and listen to me sing because I got a horrible singing voice, but I love to sing, so that makes it twice as bad. So, that little X button up there, you know you want to. You can click it. Leave, leave a rating. Rating's down here. Leave a comment, but make sure it's a good comment. I don't want any bad comments. So leave a good comment and rate, rate really high preferably, and then you can click that X button up there. You keep saying you've got something for me, 
Something you call love, but confess You've been a messin' where you shouldn't have been a messin' And now someone else is getting all your best These boots are made for walking And that's just what they'll do One of these days these boots are gonna walk all over you and that is because I danced to that song when I was in fifth grade dance class, and it was one of my favorite dances. Polly wants a cracker. I think I should get off her first. I think she wants some water to put out the blowtorch. It isn't me. Haven't seen. Let me clip your dirty wings. Let me take a ride. Don't hurt yourself. Who wants some help? I help myself. And that one is a bad memory song. And I don't feel like going into it right now because my, my sister is still awake in the house. And we have a pretty small house and my mom could hear me and I don't have anywhere to hide with decent lighting to tell you about it. But just... Not a very happy song for me, but I figure I've got to throw in a little Debbie Downerism up in here. Uh, yeah. Eight six seven five three zero oh, nine. Jenny, Jenny, who can I turn to? <laughs> yeah, that is me and Danelle, one of our driving songs, and the other of our driving song is here. I'll always sing the chorus too because I know it's really bad. <coughs> Whoa, here she comes. Watch out, boys, she'll chew you up. Oh, here she comes. She's a man eater. <laughs> That's our other driving song. We we drive to 80s pop music because <laughs> we're awesome. And to end my montage, high fidelity by Elvis Costello. Always reminds me of John Cusack. I think it was because he was in a movie called High Fidelity. So, again, I apologize if you sat through... You know what? I don't apologize. If you sat through my singing, it was your own damn fault. I told you to exit out of the window. So, I hope that you enjoyed this vlog. I will probably be MIA next week because... My, my, my misting teeth. My wisdom teeth. I'm getting them cut out. And I'm going to get some... I'm going to get some darn good pain medication for that. And I'm probably going to be out for the entire weekend. So, I will see you guys when I see you.